I'm Brother Joffrey. What do you want? Emperor Uriel, do you know something about his death? You brought me the amulet of kings? This cannot be. Let me see it. By the Nine, this is the amulet of kings. Who are you? How did you get this? What do you know of the Emperor's death? As unlikely as your story sounds, I believe you. Only the strange destiny of Uriel Septim could have brought you to me, carrying the Amulet of Kings. His meaning is unclear to me as well. The Emperor seemed to perceive some threat from the demonic world of Oblivion. The Prince of Destruction, Merun's Dagon, is one of the Lords of Oblivion. But the mortal world is protected from the Daedra of Oblivion by magical barriers. I'm not sure. Only the Emperors truly understand the meaning behind the rituals of coronation. The Amulet of Kings is ancient. Saint Delicia herself received it from the gods. It is a holy relic of great power. When an emperor is crowned, he uses the amulet to light the dragon fires at the Temple of the One in the Imperial City. The emperor dead and no new heir crowned, the dragon fires in the temple will be dark for the first time in centuries. It may be that the dragon fires protected us from a threat that only the emperor was aware of. I am one of the few who know of his existence. Many years ago, I served as captain of Uriel's bodyguards, the Blades. One night, Uriel called me to his private chambers. A baby boy lay sleeping in a basket. Uriel told me to deliver him somewhere safe. He never told me anything else about the baby, but I knew it was his son. From time to time he would ask about the child's progress. Now it seems that this illegitimate son is the heir to the Septim throne, if he yet lives. His name is Martin. He is a priest in the chapel of Akatosh, in Kavach. Yes, Kavach. I cannot believe that the attack on Kavach is a coincidence. The enemy seem to know all our secrets. You must return to Kovach at once and rescue Martin if he lives. There is no time to lose. If there's anything you need, please ask. My resources here are limited, but I will help in any way I can. The coronation of each new emperor is sealed when he uses the Amulet of Kings to light the dragon fires in the Temple of the One. The dragon fires of Akatosh remain lit until the death of the emperor. His successor then lights the menu upon ascending to the throne. With Emperor Uriel dead and no successor crowned, the Temple of One will be dark for the first time in centuries. He is a priest in the chapel of Akatosh in Kavach. He never knew that he was Uriel Septim's son. You need to find him at once and bring him safely back here. I keep a few things here in my chest to resupply traveling blades. Help yourself to whatever you need. Your first priority now should be to find Martin and bring him back here. The Daedra Prince of Destruction, an inveterate foe of all mortal races. He was involved with Jagger Tharn's plot against the Empire years ago. It doesn't surprise me to find his hand in the current calamity. Waste no time. You must find Martin before the enemy does.